From Cardinal Ridge, we have Swoop. From Mill Run, we have Lightning. From Cedar Lane, we have Roar. From Sanders Corner, we have Swerf. And commanding all the chaos, we have the Playground Fair. Children all across Loudoun County have been getting hurt on the playground and through the recess times. The Playground Fairy is here today to help us enforce safe play. It is very important for our teachers to supervise their children at play. It is important to behave and follow these general rules to prevent injury and promote safe play. On the corkscrews, make sure to only have one person jump at a time. Remain upright while using the poppers. Only one person at a time on the fireman's pole. Make sure to climb hand over hand to prevent hand burn. Always climb the dome with three points of contact. Make sure to remain on the outside of the dome only and keep your hands and feet to yourself. Always remain upright on the roller coaster. Dismount stepping down one foot at a time to keep your hands and feet to yourself. Only one person on each individual top. Use three points of contact and always remain upright on the floating tops. Always climb up or down the spring using three points of contact. On the rock climber, just not stepping down one foot at a time. Only one person at a time and make sure to use the chain to climb up only. On the bridge, keep all hands and feet inside the side rails. Dismount the bridge by stepping down one foot at a time. Only two people should be on the balance beam at one time. Keep hands and feet to yourself while you are on the balance beam. Each elementary school in Loudoun County has a different playground. It is the responsibility of the physical education teacher and the classroom teacher to provide specific playground rules and expectations for your school. Recess and outdoor activity is very important to your health and your education. Using the playground equipment properly will make sure that you get plenty of exercise while doing it safely. If you have any questions about your playground equipment at your school, you can see your PE teacher or your classroom teacher.